Hello guys, you are watching Experience in Finite. In today's video, I am going to demonstrate you a digital voltmeter which I designed using Atmega 328P microcontroller. So I am going to demonstrate you its working using 18650 lithium ion battery. So here on the LCD screen, you can see its voltage is 3.832 volt DC and it is so precise. So let's start the video. I'll explain every component I've used in this voltmeter. So let's start with the battery itself. That is the main power supply of the circuit. It has inbuilt 18650 lithium ion battery. It is a 1200 mAh battery. It gives long lasting and there is one more thing it has inbuilt type C charging port. Using that we can charge the battery. So the battery gives 4.2 volt maximum. So here I'm using step up module which its, its input is 3.7 volt DC and output it will give up to 12 volts. So here I am using this module because it is really power efficient. So this voltmeter having uh, Atmega 328P microcontroller which is being programmed using this USB to TTL module. So here we can use Arduino software to program the microcontroller. So this microcontroller is having inbuilt 4 analog pins but here I am using ADS1115 analog to digital converter it is a 16 bit ADC the reason we are using this ADC is it's uh, it is 16 bit and, and it calculates voltage ranges from 1 millivolt to 5 volt and this ADC is very much precise so this voltmeter is capable of reading four different voltage values at the same time how is this possible this is because this ADC is having four analog pins which is capable of reading all the four different voltages at the same time I achieved this range using a voltage divider circuit that divides the voltage and it will convert it into a range of 5 volt and it will give it to the microcontroller itself there are two stack of voltage divider circuit after dividing the voltage, the voltage value will be too much smaller and it has a very low current. So here I am using LM358 operational amplifier which is being used as a non-inverting voltage follow circuit which gives the voltage value to the ADC and ADC read all the voltage values and display all the voltage value on the 16 by 2 I2C based LCD screen. So here you can see this is the dura cell and its voltage is 1.590 volt so the voltmeter is fully calibrated and it is very much precise it will display the perfect value of the voltage source if we change the resistor stack it is even capable to read voltage ranges from more than 250 volt dc so guys talking about the programming part of the digital voltmeter so there are three methods I will explore over here. The first one is you can directly display the voltage which is read by the ADC but this method is not good because ADC continuously reads the voltage value and display it on the LCD screen. So every time you will get to see a different voltage value over there. So after that I used averaging method that means in a second or in a time of a two seconds it will read at least 50 to 100 values make its average and display it on the screen still this is not that precise method to read the voltage value the third one which is the best method that is exponential moving algorithm and the software filtering if you use these two methods to read the voltage value we can have a perfect voltmeter this is the best and the perfect method to read the voltage values and that's it for today if you like the video hit the like button and if you want to see such type of content then please subscribe to my channel thank you so much